Today I want to talk to you about the phases of disruption that we're going to be going through as a business as we tackle this coronavirus crisis. Now this crisis presents probably the greatest challenge from a leadership and a management perspective we'll ever face in a lifetime. A lot greater than what we faced in 2008 with the financial crisis. Now what we're going to be seeing as a business are four distinct phases this crisis is going to go through. And as a business, you need to be responding accordingly to each phase. Let me take you through each of these in turn. So, firstly, phase one. Here we're waiting for the impact. As much as the economy starts to shut down to prevent the spread of infection, effects of these measures are both sharp and severe. Here we will start seeing businesses trying to adapt to a new way of working, trying to operate as best they can with teams working remotely. In this phase, both businesses and households we use financial coping mechanisms just to go and get by. Phase two, this is about withstanding the impact. As sickness and infection quickly starts to mount and the economy grinds to complete halt, businesses will be starting to run out of money, even as the government funding starts to trickle through into the economy. Or they start to struggle due to illnesses, whilst many households will be grappling with making ends meet. And then phase three, here we start returning to normal. As infections start to decline, either through medical progress or people have the virus and much of the population starts developing immunity, economic activity starts to resume and get back to normal due to both growing confidence and the sheer necessity of getting things moving again. Finally, phase four. This is about establishing a new way of working. Here, industry dynamics will be redefined as both B2C and B2B behaviours are seen lasting changes, and the nature of competition for many companies shifts for years to come. So as a business, these are the four stages you were having to respond to. As to how long each of these stages are, and the depth of each of these stages, at this stage, we do not know. Importantly, as a business and as business leaders, you need to be aware of what stage you are in, and make sure you adapt your strategy accordingly.